This is Dr. Shakil Ahmed. Today I want to discuss the ultrasound application of gut signature sign. The gut signature sign is an ultrasound term used to describe the appearance of the gastrointestinal wall. The ball wall has five layers composed of alternating hyperechoic and hypoechoic appearances. Anatomically, these layers are as follow. First of all, the superficial mucosal layer. This layer is echogenic. This is not a true layer, but this is the interface between the lumen and wall of the gut. The second layer is mucosal. The mucosal layer is hypoechoic. The third is submucosal. This is echogenic layer and this is the thickest layer. Fourth is the muscularis propria. This layer is appeared hypoechoic on ultrasound. In the outermost layer is serosa, which is also echogenic. Diagnostic application of the gut signature sign is to distinguish normal bowel from other structures. Secondly, to diagnose the pathology due to its disruption. In case of inflammations, all layers will be expanded and therefore thickened. While in case of masses, it tends to disrupt the layers. The gut signature can be used to differentiate the benign and malignant conditions. In benign conditions, where gut signature is preserved in long segments of bowels are involved, while in malignant conditions, where there is destruction of the gut structure and the signature is destroyed, usually short segment of bowel are involved. As we know that the gut has four layers. The outermost is the serosa and then there is the muscular layer and in order to that, there is submucosa and mucosa and the lumen. The fifth layer, that is the interface between the lumen and the mucosal layer. This is the image of the normal gut. We can appreciate the interface between the lumen and the mucosa, the mucosa, the submucosal layer, the muscular layer, and also the serosal. This image shows the interface between the lumen and the mucosa, the mucosal layer, the submucosal layer, the muscular layer, and the outermost which is the serosal layer.